the beefy squad checking in. Hurry work, up. Work. Time for work. I was just coming down the stairs and banged my head on the ceiling. <laughs> A very exciting delivery has just turned up. I'm gonna set up my new skateboard on my lunch break. Welcome to the start of a weekly vlog. We've got lots of stuff going on, haven't we, this week, Al? She just did a whole video on her Dyson Air app, look, doing all her hair, and the battery died randomly and corrupted the whole clip. L literally, I was doing the last curl, wasn't I? Yeah. And, and then, then it just turned off. How's your breakfast? Delicious. Is it? We've got lots of things going on this week, so instead of just dedicating one day to filming, I thought we would do a whole week so that you can see what we get up to. I couldn't sleep this morning. I kept having that horrible dream where you think you're going to miss your alarm. Oh, that's the worst. I've just come back in from my lunch break. I went for a really nice walk around our area. There's like a beautiful nature park that we have literally on our doorstep. I try and get out every single day and just have a little walk at lunchtime to clear my head, especially when I'm looking at a screen all day. It really does help. Now I'm going to crack on with the rest of my work for this afternoon and then Elle will be home. We will go to the gym and we've got food shopping to do tonight. So exciting stuff. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Did I scare you? <laughs> Sorry. I didn't know hey. that was all that stood in okay. black. How's your day? Good, thank you. Busy? Busy. Busy bee. And your curls have still stayed in. I know. I can't believe it. I think I've actually mastered it now. Yeah, you've mastered it. Ready for the gym? Trevor, you having a coffee? Coffee. Elle gets home from work and then always has either a Kit Kat, a Squares bar a with a coffee before we go to the gym. Yeah, that's like my little routine. Ready for the gym? I don't spend my life on TikTok, unlike you. Bloody TikTok addict over here. When you're not giving me attention, actually. <laughs> so Why do girls need attention 24 7? Because we're humans. I don't need attention 24 7. Oh, you wait. What, so you would happily sit and do nothing, would you? If I, and I'll just do something. No, well, no, not do you nothing. I have phone. to be occupied. You come off your phone for two seconds and. Ellen, get off your phone! No. If, if I've got something to do, I'm all right. If I couldn't just sit there and do nothing. Exactly. Huh? Oh, they're on the floor. Oh, that thing, I still keep banging my head on it. Bang my head on the <laughs> Have you got a mask? Um, oh, we need masks, don't we? Have you got a mask? <laughs> sake! Oh, I've got one in my pocket. I've got one in my pocket. <laughs> What's that? It's the beefy squad checking in. Beefy girl and beefy boy who are not feeling very beefy today. Because I'm feeling the wrong kind of beefy. <laughs> She's doing that typical no, girl no, thing. No, it's not. I Do just I look, look quite self conscious today. Oh, okay, that's fair enough. Well, you look good. And your hair, look at her hair. We're laying off the caffeine, so we're kind of training at the moment with minimal caffeine, which just makes life a lot harder. I'm not doing it anymore. No. <laughs> Weirdly enough, I'm actually in the mood tonight to go food shopping. I'm never in the mood to go food shopping. So. You're not. Make the most of it. Normally, I have to there drag you go. him around. You like do some vlogging, hey? Oh, I just have my hand over the camera. Where do I look? Right here. Oh, That's oh so I am achy though. Well, look, you can see my freckles. I've got foundation on. I actually get real bad, real bad. I actually really love them, actually. I get real yeah, I love prominent them. freckles 
in the summer. Huh? She can't get through there. She can. She it's actually mapping. just gave you the why, biggest. Why? If, kill, if stairs no, could kill. I actually hate so impolite people. How do they look at you like? <laughs> Where are you going? Right, Fab, oh, we're I'm... going left, honey. No, we're... are we? We're going to Lidl. I always get confused between Lidl and Aldi. L Lidl I is cannot... a little bit away from the flat. Yeah, that is the methodology that we used That's to. how I actually had to teach Fab. That Lidl was a little bit away from where we used to live. And Aldi was Aldi way in town. <laughs> <laughs> Otherwise, you'd ask him to go to um, Lidl and then he'd go to Aldi. And you asked him to go to Aldi and he'd go to Lidl. You actually always got them the opposite way around. Yeah. Maybe I should have just said to go to the opposite one. They're like the same shop the there, pretty much. No, Lidl is much better. Do you reckon? Much better. You used to not It has like a Lidl. wider range of choices, Lidl does. And it has more in the like middle aisles of like branded stuff that for cheaper. And also at Lidl you can go through the checkout, self-checkout, so they don't throw your stuff at you. Oh yeah, Aldi doesn't but have that. Aldi one. doesn't have that. So that Aldi they big, literally is... launch your stuff at you and I had to have it's... training for that. Yeah, Al is is qualified in Backpacking. I actually, I'm actually pretty good. I got pretty good actually because I had to go on my own during lockdown. You were rapid. Oh, that woman was crying. Was she? Oh, I hope she's okay. Oh. Was she actually? Yeah. Oh, bless her. Maybe she stubbed her toe. And she is very happy. Oh, oh. her boyfriend clearly makes her very the happy. The contrast. I just bought a new way. Spend a couple thousand just to cruise it. Shawty said she love me, but I swear she never prove it. I never tell her, but I put it in the music. What I said. What was that? Angry. I got beat that. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? That is my angry dance. <laughs> move, move, move. Right. That's how kangaroos fight. <laughs> She's still laughing about this kangaroo getting punched in the face. Let it go, dogs. Let's go. <laughs> the other dog's coming. It's you... the way they like. And then he just goes like. <laughs> and the kangaroo's like. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what would you do if a kangaroo came up to you? Shrank myself and run away. I would not be boxing it. I would. I'd be going. No, have you seen them? Some of them are hench. You get some hench <laughs> no, ones. Not... They actually go gin. They actually deadlift more than us. <laughs> yeah, have kangaroo gin. Move out of the way. <laughs> Fab, I'm starving. Sure. It's 10 to 7. Hurry right, up. Right, okay, well, we better put this away fast then. There we go. And Al has got our steaks on the go. I mean, Al, I'm not going to lie. What? They do look a little bit cremated. No. So there's an art to cooking steak. There is, and I don't know what it is. I it's never knew they did this. Sauce. Look, they got peppercorn sauce in uh, Lidl. My sister actually introduced me to this. What, the Lidl one? No. Oh, what? Peppercorn sauce. Peppercorn sauce. Mm. Yeah, it's good. Mm -hmm. You um, used to have beef dripping sauce, didn't you? Oh, from but, Miller and Carter. But peppercorn sauce is good on st uh, from Miller and Carter. We're having steak and chips, by the way. Steak, chips, and peas. On a Monday, treat yourself, eh? We both like crispy chips, but we're both too impatient to wait, wait for that. So we just end up having anemic chips. <laughs> Going in for the taste test. How do you usually have your steak? I'm doing well. Mm -hmm. Good? Mm -hmm. That is a very wonky angle, but I'm too hungry right now to fix this. I told you, didn't I? Oh. That's good though. After dinner is always the worst time of day because I've got to bloody do the washing up for the night. To be fair, it's actually quite a nice sort of five, 10 minutes to just unwind for the day and think about how your day's gone whilst you're doing your washing up. I caught you mm. on TikTok. No, you didn't, not really. I did. Mm. Is it bad time now? This is Ellen's favourite time of day. It's my favourite time of day. I actually look forward to this time of day all day. Really? It is nice just getting into bed, isn't it? Mm. It's eight o'clock now. We typically get into bed around half seven, eight. We try to be asleep by like nine-ish, don't we? Yeah. Around nine, because then you're getting enough sleep to be able to get up at five, five thirty. Well, it's late and hours, you're not. isn't it? Mm. 
eight hours sleep. Bish bash bosh, you're ready to go for the next morning. It's Tuesday morning, we always start our day. Elle's already ready, but she usually gets ready whilst I'm editing in the corner. I'll edit our YouTube videos. We just wanted to say, for the last video we uploaded, the comment section is so nice, isn't it? Yeah. I can't, I honestly can't believe, we sit there and read them and we're like, wow, how are people so nice? <laughs> so thank you for supporting and I hope you're enjoying this video so far. Elle's in a rush, I don't know if you could tell. She needs to go. I'm so late for work, I've just filmed my Dyson Air Up review for the third time because the clips kept corrupting. Um, so yeah, now I'm late. I've got to go and literally get dressed, have my breakfast, scoff it down, take a ready meal and rush to work. A <laughs> ready meal? You yeah, look great, I, by the way. I haven't got Your time. Your hair looks, look at her bouncy little hair. My pussy blow dry. Uh, by the way, guys, the next video is my Dyson Air App review and I have mastered it. My curls last time lasted three days and... It's so simple how I've made them last. So if you're interested, make sure you watch that, please, because it's my first video on my own. <laughs> Again. Time for work. The dynamic range on the iPhones still blow my mind. Like, look, it's got me you got the detail in me, but then you can also see the detail in the sky there. How nuts is that? If you're thinking of starting YouTube, right, and you've got a decent iPhone, like you could quite easily do YouTube through the iPhone 12 Pro and not need a camera. Like it is good. The only thing that lets it down is the audio, but you can buy like plug-in mics and stuff to combat that. The drive to work is about 35 minutes, which I now actually really enjoy as opposed to before lockdown when I just was fed up of driving. Now I enjoy drives. I don't know if you guys feel the same, but it's just nice to actually get out and drive. I go to work probably twice a week, um, which is just a nice change from home. Can we take it back to So it is lunchtime. I am now heading back over to HQ to have lunch. So where I walked in this morning, that is GSHQ. And where the brand team work is GSLC, which is down there. So I'm walking back over for lunch now. They always do incredible food at Gymshark. And there's a guy mowing the lawn, which is very loud. Good day so far, productive day. I'm doing a lot of animating on After Effects today. Ancient, but sons and daughters. That shit was amazing. Can we take it back? That is elite framing. You're balanced on the window. I've been staring at a computer screen all, all day. Oh, you've been so, planning, ain't you? So a bit like... Yeah, welcome to my world. I don't know how you do it. Why are you opening it like that? I can't get my finger under that. Can you do it? What, so instead you'll risk your teeth? What? I'm just getting a catch in it a little bit. Just, you've just been fizzing this up. I ain't been fizzing it up. You have, that's why it's like that. Who on their right mind fizzes up their own drink before they drink it? Yeah, but like not, not you might not have done it because like, you can't get your finger under there because you fizzed it up. It's the that's cringing me out trying to get my. I can do it. I can do it. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> I can do it. I'll do. I'll do. I'll do it. That's it. Go go go. Oh. Lovely knocko. That actually makes my ears hurt. We're gonna drink these drinks and then we are going to the lifting club. We're doing legs, aren't we? Mm. Hey! <laughs> yeah. Back from the gym and we've got a very hangry Ellen. We are both cooking dinner together. And we have got chicken pesto pasta which Elle found the recipe to online. Is it like a healthy one Elle? It's supposed to be yeah. Yeah? I mean I've way overcooked but. <laughs> oh my god. We used to make this with um, what <laughs> like it? the most unhealthy option ever. Was it like mozzarella? Yeah, like and... mozzarella yeah. 
God, it was tasty. Loads of mozzarella, didn't we? Yeah. Loads of. Back in the flat. Or teaspoons. Teaspoons or tablespoons? Teaspoons, I think. Just put two of those. Two on. of those. Don't. Oh, Fabian. used milk that had gone off in their coffee. Lovely. This is what our bedroom looks like every morning. It's a constant cycle of throwing pillows on the floor and then putting them back on the bed like this. Does anyone else do this? It's pointless really, isn't it? But do you know what? I actually find it really satisfying making the bed and it is a very, very good habit to get into to just do every single day when you wake up. Starts your day off right. Ah. I was just coming down the stairs and bang my head on the ceiling. I've never done that before. <sighs> Ouch. Hi, are you alright? New skateboard. Let's open it up. In fact, let's eat lunch first because. I am absolutely starving. It is 20 to 1. I usually have my lunch at 12, but I was in a good groove with work today, so I carried on. Here, we have got two bagels with ham and cheese. Absolutely classic combination. But then, mixing it up, we've got some gherkins in there. Controversial, I know, but I do love a gherkin. And then we've got mayonnaise, bit of Branston pickle, and some pop chips. I've just realised... What the hell am I doing inside when it's such a nice day outside? Oh, Lord. Right, I'm not going to lie to you. I just filmed a whole sequence. Well, I thought I filmed a whole sequence of me unboxing this. And then I realised the camera wasn't even recording. So that is the most fab thing that I could possibly do. But this is what we got. A new skateboard deck from Route 1. Absolutely gorgeous. You probably know by now that I'm into my skateboarding, but if not, then here you go. And I'm going skateboarding tomorrow evening, so I will include that in this video, and I'll be setting this up and taking this, so that'll be good fun. As well as that, this evening we are going to play rounders with some friends. Round I've not played rounders since literally since high school, and the weather is absolutely beautiful today, so that is going to be very fun. Bye now. Go on. Uh, Oh yeah. Rounders done. That was good fun, wasn't it, Al? I literally look so rough. But no, you don't. <laughs> we ended up um, fielding, didn't we, for ages? Yeah. Because the batters stayed in and we couldn't get them out. They were good though. They were good. Oh, you need to do a bit of vlogging because it's been me. You've been at school the whole week. <laughs> Sorry. It's just me talking. I'm talking tomorrow. Okay, Al's gonna do some talking tomorrow. <laughs> Because I don't work at home, I can't whack my phone out of work and be like, hey guys, no, that's speak fair. to the weekly vlog? <laughs> right, it's shout out time. So this week, the shout out goes to Isabella, who says, I literally look forward to your videos every week. You're so relatable and such a breath of fresh air. You're also both bloody hilarious. Thanks a lot, Isabella. I don't know about hilarious, we're just a pair of idiots, but thank you very much for your support. If you guys would like a shout out, then all you need to do is drop a comment down below and we choose someone at random every single week. Back to the video. The two things that I had planned for today, so lunchtime, I was gonna go and get my hair cut. That's been cancelled because my barber's ill. Obviously, you can't help that, but I have got a very dead trim at the moment. The last time I tried to get my hair cut, I drove all the way into town, got stuck in mad traffic, and then had to come home because I ran out of time on my lunch. So that's not happening, hence the beanie. Also, I'm meant to be skating tonight, which I've been excited for the whole week. The one day I want to go somewhere, rains. It's absolutely soaking outside, so I'm hoping it dries up by this evening, but... We'll see. It's lunchtime and a very exciting delivery has just turned up. Yesterday we had a skateboard. Today we've got something even more exciting. Sweets from Woody's Pick Your Mix. Oh my God, look at this stuff. Look at the size of this bag full of fizzy sweets. Oh my word. That's gotta be like a kilo of sweets there. Well it is, I think. 
have already opened it up. I couldn't resist, but oh my god. I'm going to leave the link to these guys in the description. Go and order yourself some sweets. They come right to your door and you can. there's a wide variety of stuff you can order. And they're just like... Just oh, good. Okay. I'm going to set up my new skateboard on my lunch break. I haven't really got the right tools to do the grip tape. So for those of you that don't know, this stuff is called grip tape. It sits on the top of the skateboard like that and it basically scrapes on your shoe. It's like sandpaper and it grips to your shoe and allows you to do tricks and stuff. In order to put it on nicely and cleanly, you need like a razor, like a Stanley knife, but we've lost ours. So I'm gonna try and do it with a normal kitchen knife. So it's satisfying. <laughs> We are done. Got some stickers on the top. These trucks are not quite wide enough for this board, but we'll make it work. Unfortunately, I am not going skateboarding tonight now because my friend Connor is busy tonight. So I'm not gonna bother because it was like an hour away and I don't fancy going on my own. But I'm gonna go to the gym with Elle instead. I've had a good day at work today. I've gotta say, I absolutely love this office setup now. Now that I've got everything sorted and how I want it, it's perfect. And this desk from FlexiSpot is an absolute godsend. Funnily enough, we had like a meeting this morning, which was like going over posture and how we should sit with Paddy, who's the guy who does like all of our sports massages and that sort of stuff. And I was messing around and talking about how I've got a standing desk. Now this desk is amazing because I can get myself into the exact position I need to be because by adjusting this. I'll show you right now, look. <laughs> oh! Okay. I went a bit too much there. Because of the amount of time I spend sat at this desk, I, this is just essential for me. So if you're in a similar situation, working from home or you like editing a lot, definitely think about picking up one of these standard desks. We do have an affiliate link, which I'll put in the description below. So you'll be helping us if you buy through that. But trust me when I say the quality of these things are incredible and the price is actually really reasonable when you consider that it could like save you injury or bad posture. It's just worth getting. So check that out down below. Look who's home. Let's see if we can scare her. Hey! Oh. <laughs> there we go. Hey, I'm on vacation. Every single man because of one little occasion. Pardon? That is definitely not the lyrics. This coffee is grank. Gross. Grank. <laughs> it's really strong. Yeah, because you're about to go to the gym. I don't like it. You don't like it? Can you put some more milk in? Oh. Okay. Please. <laughs> 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 I have no one. <laughs> Like, who gets off a chair and then forgets that <laughs> the chair is there? The things I do for you, eh? Tell me when to stop. Uh, um, more. <laughs> what was that? You're like a toddler. More? No, I just think you've... How many scoops did you put in? 17. He always has his camera so exposed, so overexposed. Oh, all right. Look at it. Only a tiny bit. But if I'm overexposed, you're not. Oh, you are a bit, actually. Still. Piece of crap. Oh, you know what? You try and do something nice for someone. What do they do? Spit it in your face. Are you tipping it away? Yeah. <gasps> how much? It's serious. Because how much coffee did you put in it? Ellen, I only put five tablespoons of coffee. What? What? What are you doing? Why are you saying oh no? Because I was going to sneeze in my coffee, but I was trying to like not do it, and I did it. Tell me how your day's been. Let's have a look. <laughs> I was going to say you know. <laughs> How's your day been? Um, um, tiring. Tiring. I could have had a nap at, at, at lunch. 
Why is there socks on the table? I don't mind. You could have had a nap. Mm. What you've been doing? Just two then? seconds. How rude. Today has been, ugh, ugh, to be honest, not a very good day. I okay. felt a little bit crap today. I think a combination of things. Number one, because I was meant to get a haircut and go skateboarding, and they've both been cancelled. I mean, it's no one's fault, but they've both been cancelled, and it's always a bit crap when your plans don't go ahead. And number two, I just pff, haven't worked through my to-do list as well as I could have. Right. What? No, that's not even funny. I see a weed. Where is he? Uh-oh, you better run, weed. Look at it. Oh. Look at that. Oh, my God. Are you sure it's not a flower? No, that is a weed. Get him. You need to get all your roots. Get him out. Oh, that's good weed picking, that is. Have you seen the amount on the weekend? We're going to have to do the ones out the front. There's so many. Yeah, I know. You keep spraying them with the weed all. Weed all. <laughs> yeah, then. <laughs> oh, yeah. Right, well, you're going to the gym then? I didn't shut that into next to Neighbours Garden, by the way. That's our alleyway. Eight o'clock, bedtime again. We went to the gym, came back. To be completely honest with you, not really feeling myself today, but I usually have one day a week where that happens. As long as you know what to do to make yourself feel a bit better, which for me was tidying up the office where I'd been working because it was a bit of a mess and also having a nice shower and a shave and I feel a lot better now. And lads, if you're wondering, to do the beard, I use a number three on the sides. I use a number one on like my moustache and then I use a zero, just the clippers to shape up around the bottom and then I use what are those things called a cutthroat razor to like shape up the sides and down here and yeah that's how we do it. Do you remember when you sit them down? Yeah. And um I might get these. Friday today, I've had the day off. I went to go and see my mum, did a bit of shopping, had a nice meal with her, and then did a little bit of skateboarding in the afternoon. Elle's been at work today. How's your day been now? Tiring? Yeah. <laughs> we are finishing the week with a film, which is rare for Ellen Brownie. We're actually in bed. We're in bed. Ah. We've got some pick and mix. We're watching Fatherhood, or about to watch Fatherhood on Netflix, because I've heard it's good with Kevin Hart. We've had a full-on week. Yeah, Lots we have. of We've stuff. We've had a crazy busy week. It's been really busy. Oh, these sweets. They're good, aren't they? So I hope you've enjoyed watching our week. And do you want more weekly vlogs? Do you want us, do you prefer it when it's like more mm. footage in the week? Or do you just prefer like the weekend vlogs? We're going to do both. We're actually filming a vlog tomorrow, aren't we? As well. Yeah, like uh, organise the house. Mm. Clean. We got lots of stuff to do around the house. Yeah, the house has not even off. been touched for like weeks, has mm, it really? Months, <laughs> pretty like, much. Literally, so we we are totally just doing a full thing. And, just and I'm going to organise my walk, my summer clothes. Oh my god, yeah, you're, yeah, that needs to be done. Anyway, that is the end of this video. Thank you very much for watching. Make sure you follow us on Instagram and subscribe for more content. And we will see you next week. Bye.